I'm Doug Apple and my heart is on fire. Luke 24, 32. I remember going out on Friday nights with high expectations. It's going to be the best time ever. There were high expectations of fun, of making memories, laughter, good times, great music, and stories to tell. But at some point, I started thinking thoughts like, it's never really all that. Even in the best case scenario, I began thinking thoughts like, there's got to be more. I didn't know it at the time, but those thoughts were laying the foundation inside me for something huge. What it did was finally put me in a place where I was willing to respond to God, willing to move in His direction and find out more. So do you find yourself thinking thoughts like, there's got to be more? If so, what's happening is that your heart and mind are getting ready for a change. You're going to seek out something new, and I want to recommend this to you. Seek God. James 4.8 says, Draw near to God and he will draw near to you. Hebrews 11.6 says that God is a rewarder of those who diligently seek him. Jesus said, Come to me, all you that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. I am gentle and lowly in heart, and you will find rest for your soul. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. He said, I have come that you may have life and that you may have it more abundantly. Isaiah 42.3 indicates that even if your light is barely burning at all, he will not put it out. Instead, he will come along and fan it into a flame, giving light and warmth and fire to your life. Isaiah 1.18 says that though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be as white as snow. This is what Jesus will do in your life. When you come to the place of dissatisfaction with this world and a place of hunger for something more. Your motto used to be eat, drink, and be merry. But Romans 14, 17 says the kingdom of God is not about eating and drinking, but instead it's about something vastly more substantial. Righteousness and peace and joy in the Holy Spirit. Have you been thinking these thoughts lately? Thoughts like, there's got to be more. Well, I'm telling you, there is more, way more. And you can begin finding it by simply saying, Heavenly Father, please show me the way. May God bless you today. I'm Doug Apple.